Look okay, at that many tricks, man. <laughs> Turns out six crank works and it wasn't uh, invite and um, yeah I ended up making the final and um, yeah just kind of kind of snowball from there and yeah I mean the, the the big mountain style of riding has really been coming back lately it's uh, you know more like a snowboard style of riding pick pick your own line the stuff out there is get it's getting really big and it's like it's actually it's actually pretty hard to judge when it's starting to get that that big you know Mike Hopkins like. Sent, sent that, that uh, it was probably a 70 foot step down and he went 90 feet. He got pretty smashed. People want big mountain mountain biking to be snowboarding, it's not. You know, it, it's really hard to ride steep stuff and uh, it, you know, the camera sometimes doesn't even do it justice. No way, you can ride down there. Bearclaw is, he's like one of the most talented riders around, I reckon he's got so much experience on his belt. He, he builds courses. He can he can ride anything you put in front of him. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he's like he's the he's like one of the only riders on on the tour who's older than me. Yeah. <laughs> so like, well, if he's still doing it, I'm doing it, man. It's awesome. New Zealand's a it's a really good off-season destination, really. Like if you if you ride in, in Whistler and stuff, like when when the snow comes and you want to keep riding mountain bike, you know it's it's a pretty good option. Yeah. Head down to New Zealand, dirt jumps. Just got the gondola running. You know, you've got a lot of different options and a good crew, yeah. good times.